This next one could be take any song I put on here, Hello Everybody. Hello everybody, yes indeed, yes indeed my friends, yes indeed my friends. And have them make up a new way to sing the ending. But that can be, again, challenging for some kids when they've learned the ending a particular way. It gets really hard to break out of that mold. So um, I know Jen Bailey has a bunch of really fantastic unfinished songs. I have one that I, for a long time I didn't realize I wrote it because I thought it was Jen's. And then I realized, no, I just one day couldn't remember Jen's song. So I made this one up. <laughs> it was my song all along. Um, so it goes like this. <laughs> This time we're all gonna make up an ending to the song. Yadam badam yadam badam badam yadam bam badam 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 yadam bam. Ooh yeah! And one thing that's helpful too is notice because you're so good at predicting. Part of the psychology of music is being able to take in all of the aspects of the music that you're hearing and make a prediction about what the most likely thing is you're gonna hear next. Did you notice you all tended to improvise something that was similar to what everybody else did? Because that was based on the rhythms you were hearing, the phrasing, the balance. You all just kind of knew what would probably make the most sense. Um, kids, they're more likely to be split second imitating one another. So you might find yourself having to be like, oh, I heard somebody go, ba -da 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 -bum -bum -ba -da -da. they went up high, or I heard somebody that did this down lower. Just to make it explicit all the different possibilities so you don't just get the same thing over.